Burpage Arts High School in Golden Valley has a new executive director. He faces a tremendous challenge after a legislative audit released earlier this year pointed out management issues and declining enrollment. Reporter Shannon Slatton sat down with new executive director Kurt Trigstad, who is optimistic about the future of the school. These kids are high academic flyers, but they're also exceptionally gifted artists in their own way. If you've never set foot in the doors of the Perpich Center, you can tell right away that it is a high school like none other. The artwork on the lockers that line the halls are a true testament to the school's unique identity. Feels good to be back in the arts. New executive director Kurt Trigestad started off his career in education as a band director and participated in professional development programs that Perpich offers to educators. I feel good about where we're headed. Probably wouldn't have signed on had I not believed that we can make a difference. Trigastad says the school year is off to a good start and the Perpich board and staff are working to address challenges pointed out by the legislature, like declining enrollment. If we wanted 200 kids here this year, we probably could have been there, but that wouldn't be our role either. We need to keep the standards high, and I firmly believe by keeping standards high and, and holding that banner strong, that kids will come here. Uh, if you water it down, then it you never can go back. Enrollment this year is up, and Trigastad will use his background in rural Minnesota education to increase outreach. Let people know what we have to offer. Instead of assuming that they're going to come to us, uh, we need to go to them. Plus, staff will be developing a new marketing plan for students and educators that will help promote the school and professional programming. We'll do our absolute best to be the promise that Perpich uh, can be and should be. In Golden Valley, Shannon Slatton, CCX News. Another focus is better utilizing technology not only in the classrooms at Perpich, but in the outreach and professional development workshops that happen across the state.